Well, this is a Toshiba Satellite um, A135S4527. Yeah, I had to look, so I don't know it off the top of my head. But most people say it's impossible to get Windows XP installed on here because they don't have the drivers for the sound, the video, and the wireless adapter available for Windows XP. Ignore my ringtone. But um, they don't have them. Av Toshiba on their website doesn't offer them available. But after doing a bunch of Google searching, I was able to successfully get everything installed onto this computer, including the drivers, which would be. Hold on, let me type my password. Which would be. Um, whoops. Uh, not used to XP. The wireless, the sound, and the graphics card. The most important thing was to going going on the Intel website and getting the the chipset driver. And once I got the chipset driver, which is the graphics and the USB ports, USB ports. Once I got that all done, then I was able to download um, other drivers on this machine put it onto this flash drive then I could use this flash drive on this computer and once that was all said and done I have a perfectly good machine with wireless working probably can't see it but um yeah I'll show you but it is there like the wireless works 100 percent so to all those who say it is pretty impossible just keep looking on Google in fact the one driver I had the most problem with was the wireless card it's in a a Theros, I, I guess that's how you would say it. Ignore my ringtone again. But, um, a Theros, a Theros, wire, mini, PCI, Express, whatever. I actually found that on download.com. You know, the CNET, download.com. I found it there. So, that's the place to try. I don't know, but to all those who had problems, it is possible. Just, I guess, wow, uh, it's possible. Look at that. I mean, I have internet. I just installed updates on here. But, yeah, I have internet. Wireless internet. And sound and, of course, my uh, graphics chipset is well working. So, yeah, that's it. Pretty cool.